You are welcome to the Guru Perspective. I just signed off to see me, Mr. Edu, uh, speaking about the Naira note, what to saw. Still waiting for your comment, please. You, you must comment on it so that we can gather our views and know where we are headed to. Ah, then I promise then, as I was signing off, that I shall be back with two events. I must tell you that I love President Muhammad Ibrahim. They, will, they have never been a president like him. In fighting corruption, in killing corruption, in burying corruption, in finding on glorious grave where he personally had a new burying corruption. We just finished with the Naira. We told you that a time it was that the CBN of Nigeria spent 5.8 billion to print new 2.5 billion Naira. Under the president, but what is more? What I love most about my president, Muhammad Ibrahim, like I said, is that this man will never, never query you, will never, never sack you, will never, never ask you questions once you are appointed into his cabinet. Whatever you do that is a reability that brings him, he brings shame to him, brings shame to Nigeria, no, he will ask you to continue. So we have, therefore, Every member of the cabinet, other President Muhammad Ibrahim, for this past eight years, let's just continue to it. They are the luckiest of Nigeria that ever appointed to serve the government. Because whatever they did, whatever they stood for, Ibrahim will never ask for a question. Otherwise, how do you calculate this? I do need to get them. A few days ago, Farouk Sadia. The Minister of Humanitarian Affairs, uh, Disaster Management, and Quantum went to the National Assembly to defend our budget. Please, let us look at this seriously. Let, let's listen to this very seriously. Then a member of the committee of the Senate that was looking at the matter now asked her, Madam, this 206 billion, how, how did it arrive here? Other push up head. What is happening? Please, world over, the whole world over, not only in India. Listen to Madame answer. Madame said, I don't know anything about it. It was a pardon that was done by Minister of Finance and the Minister. That is Zena Amen. Hmm? The Senate Committee looked like being jolted, but those are the pretenses. Because they know what they are doing. Then one of them asked, This 206 billion, listing my brothers and my sister, 206 billion. She said, 2022 budget, I needed to do a few things. And money was put, including servicing some duty at the Northeast uh, Development Commission. That the money was not received. Re 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 uh, the Ministry of Finance now added it here. But what they put here now, this 206 is times 10 of what I demanded for 2020. Can you can you do that? What's your judgment? Uh, am I laughing? Uh, should I laugh or should I cry? Are you crying or you are laughing? That is the pitiable position we find ourselves under a president that is fighting for us. No banana country that we even allow this to be. Those people will even pretend to do something. Look what happened in Ghana. But not in Nigeria. That is another one. Please permit me to add one before I sign up to this again. And I will look at this very, very carefully. The permanent secretary in the Ministry of Justice, Mrs. Beatrice Jedi Abba, just told Simmons Committee. Of account that the documents that represent the approval given to 2.2 billion from service wide vote were all missing. The 2.2 billion is gone. The committee is asking, Where are the approvals? She came to tell the committee that all the documents related to approvals are missing. The money is gone. But this one is missing. The 
family secretary. Under President Muhammad Mubarak. Have you forgotten that monkey job into a farm of Abdullahi, uh, uh, the, the national, the current national chairman of the APC, the farm in Kano, that monkey job there and took some million away and jumped into it. Even Dr. Abdullahi Ganduji, alias Gandula, made mockery of that. Have you forgotten that uh, some terrible snakes follow up money in Makuja? Millions? Or have you forgotten so easily that Thaimans ate up all documents that gave approval to some 70 plus something billion that was said? All these are happening in this country under the leadership and supervision of President Muhammad in Nigeria without a Goodbye.